in the previous section while proving that path connectedness is a productive property we were given functions into each coordinate space xi and we used them to define a new function into the product space x the construction of such a function is purely set theoretic and in view of its importance we define it formally such functions are known as evaluation functions and we define them into products definition let set y i i element of capital i be an indexed family of sets suppose x is a set and let for each i element of capital i f i from x to y i be a function then the function e defined from x to product y i defined by e of x of i equal to f i of x for each i element of i x element of x is called the evaluation function of the indexed family of functions f i where i element of i in other words for each x element of x the ith coordinate of e of x is obtained by evaluating the ith function f i at x this justifies the use of the term evaluation function to illustrate this suppose that x is the set of all students in a class and f1 f2 x3 etc are functions specifying respectively the age the sex the height etc that is f1 of x gives the age of the person x f2 of x gives the sex and f3 of x gives the height of x and so on then the evaluation function lists against each student the information available about the student for example a typical entry will be of the form e of mr x y z equal to information about the person the following proposition characterizes evaluation functions it states that if y i where i element of i is a family of sets capital x s set and for each i element of capital i f i from x to y i f function then the evaluation function is the only function from x into product y i whose composition with the projection function pi i equals f i for all i element of capital i so to prove this proposition we need to show that the composition of evaluation function with the projection pi i is equal to f i and we need to show that this is the only function having this property for the proof let us assume that e from x to product y i is the evaluation function of the family f i then for any i element of i using the definition of e we have pi i composition e of x is equal to the i to coordinate of e of x that is e of x of i and using the definition this will be equal to f i of x so we have pi i composition e of x is equal to f i of x for every x element of capital x and this will imply that pi i composition is equal to f i so we have proved that the composition of evaluation function with the projection function is equal to f i conversely suppose that e dash from x to product y i satisfies the same property that is pi i composition e dash is equal to f i for all i element of i we need to show that evaluation function is the only function with this property so we will show that e dash is in fact equal to e itself so let us consider an arbitrary point small x from capital x then for any i element of capital i e dash of x of i is equal to pi i of e dash of x and that is equal to f i of x using the property of e dash that is pi i composition e dash 
was assumed to be f y and we know that using the definition of e this is equal to e of x of y so e of x is in fact equal to e dash of x since the point small x was arbitrary this implies that e dash is equal to e thus e is the only function from x into product y i having this property so we have proved the characterization of evaluation functions in terms of diagrams the characterization of evaluation functions says that if we are given any family fi where the functions are defined from x to yi we already have projection function defined from product yi to yi and evaluation functions are defined from x to product yi then using the above proposition we have pi i composition e is equal to f i for all i that is e is the unique function from x to product y i which makes this diagram commute for each i element of capital i next theorem states that if y i where i element of capital i is an indexed family of sets z is a set and theta i from z to y i where i element of i is a family of functions such that for any set capital x and any family f i from x to y i where i element of capital i of functions there exists a unique function e from x to z satisfying theta i composition e is equal to f i for all i element of capital i then there exists a bijection h from z to product y i such that for each i element of capital i theta i equal to pi i composition h moreover this bijection is unique in other words z is the product of y i s and theta i s are the projection functions to prove this result let h from z to product y i be the evaluation function of the family theta i where i element of capital i then by definition for each i element of capital i pi i composition h is equal to theta i using the characterization of evaluation function now it remains to show that h is a bijection we prove that h is a bijection by showing that there exists an inverse function for h we assume that x is equal to product y i and we take f i to be the projection function pi i then by hypothesis of this theorem there exists a unique function k from product y i to z such that theta i composition k is equal to pi i for each i element of capital i then we have pi i composition h composition k is equal to pi i composition h composition k and this is equal to theta i composition k and that is equal to pi i so pi i composition h composition k is equal to pi i but we know that pi i composition identity function is also equal to pi i where i d is the identity function on product y i but we know that there exists only one function whose composition with the projection function is equal to pi i namely the evaluation function so using that uniqueness part of characterization of evaluation function taking x equal to product y i and f i equal to pi i we can see that h composition k is in fact equal to identity function on product y i similarly theta i composition identity function on z is equal to theta i since theta i composition of k composition h is also equal to theta i we must have k composition h is equal to the identity function on z so h composition k is the identity function on product y i and k composition h is the identity function on z so h and k are inverses of each other thus 
H is a bijection. And uniqueness follows from the characterization of evaluation function. Definition An indexed family F5 where I element of capital I of functions all defined on the same domain X is said to distinguish points if for any distinct X and Y in capital X there exists a particular index J element of I such that Fj of X is not equal to Fj of Y. Then we say that the family of functions distinguishes points. Proposition The evaluation function of a family of functions is 1 to 1 if and only if the family distinguishes points. To prove this proposition, assume that Fi from x to yi is a function and that e from x to product yi is the evaluation function. We need to show that E is 1 to 1 if and only if the family Fi distinguishes points. To prove this, let us take two distinct points x and y of capital X. Then we assume that E of x is not equal to E of y. This is possible only if the j to coordinate of E of x is different from j to coordinate of E of y for some j. That is, if there exists a j element of capital I such that E of x of j is not equal to E of y of j. But we know that E of x of j is equal to Fj of x. And similarly, E of y of j, the j to coordinate of E of y is defined as Fj of y. So, using this definition, we can say that E of x not equal to E of y if and only if there exists j element of i such that fj of x not equal to fj of y. That is, if and only if the family fi distinguishes points.